hi welcome to this new part in this part we will learn about the take while operator so we will learn what is take while operator and then we will create some demo with the help of mix syntax and method syntax first let's understand what is take while operator take while operator is used to get all records from a data source until a specified condition is true so take while operator will return all the records as long as the given condition is true once the condition is failed take while will not validate rest elements even if the condition is true for the remaining elements okay so the line of the meaning we will understand that in the demo part take while method can be used in method syntax and mix syntax take while method will not make any change in element positions it simply return all the records until the specified condition is true how it works let's go to the visual studio and let's create a demo here i am in my visual studio and first let's create a very basic list so suppose i'm having a array of integers so suppose this is numbers int okay it has few records I need to fetch all the records from this list until the number is less than 7 okay this is the requirement so to use that we have to use the link namespace so here I can write the namespace using system and then using system dot link I have used system to use the console class console dot create line here and then I am going to apply the take while method how where method syntax numbers dot take while and in the take while first let's have a look on the take while method if I press F12 over here you will see there are two methods from the name of take while and in the first one we can pass the predicate over here and in the second one you can see that it is accepting integer and bool predicate so there are two types of predicate here we can pass the value and the index or the value only how we will learn in the later part of this video so suppose first for a very basic example I need to fetch all the records from this list where until okay it's not about all the codes it's all about until I need to fetch all the records until the number is less than 7 now x is less than 7 and at the last to execute this query I can use to list or to array method as per my requirement here I can put a breakpoint and let me press F5 now so you can see MS has 6 records and all the numbers are less than 6 but here you will have a question in your mind that we can do all the things using the where method okay why we have take while method so the difference between where and take while method is suppose here at the last I am writing some few more numbers suppose 3, 4 and 5 and let me remove 3, 4, 5 from here okay so suppose this is the condition okay so I have 1 2 6 7 and at the last I have 3 4 5 if I am going to apply where on this data source suppose the condition is where number is less than 6 then where will execute the query on each element and if any particular element satisfies the condition then it will return that particular element it doesn't matter where the element is but in case of take while take while will start fetching records from the data source until the given condition is true once the condition get failed it will not check the remaining elements how let me press f5 now let's see what is the output in the output you can see there are there are only three records what records one two and six you can see that three four five which are available in the last of the data source that is not available as output why because when the query was working on the data source first 
let's understand it in the very basic way so 1 is less than 7 true so 1 will be the part of the output then 2 is less than 7 which is the part of output 6 condition is true because it is less than 7 next we have 7 condition gets failed so take while will not check the condition on the rest of the elements it will skip all those elements and it will return only these three records the main purpose is once condition get failed take while will not check the rest elements it doesn't matter if the rest elements satisfy the condition so suppose 3 4 and 5 are satisfying the condition but the condition gets filled here at this place so they will not be considered to check the condition so that is the main difference between where and the take while let's see it with one more example here i can have a list of integers so suppose using system dot collections and now i can create a list of suppose a string so suppose a string names new list of names and in this list suppose i'm having some name kim john suppose this is my name so we have all the required namespaces over here and from this list I have to apply a condition what condition let's apply it where method syntax one because we have already one ms variable names dot take while so in the take while first we were passing only the condition now we can pass our condition in such a way that uh, name in the index okay so we will have two parameters first will be the name it will have the values of the name and the last one will have the index of the current value so suppose the condition is name dot length is greater than index okay and at the last i will write whole list method let's make some changes in the list over here and suppose here i i'm changing this name okay so in this scenario the length of the ada will be three but the index will be four so three is not greater than four that's why the condition will get failed at this plate and we will check we will get only these three records let's see whether it works or not let me press f5 now let's see how many records do we have we have only three records which records kim john and the mark because nitis is satisfying the condition but this is not the part of the output why because the condition gets failed at the fourth name ada because it is having three characters and three character is less than four the condition gets filled at this place that's why we are not having these number of records in the output if you need to apply take while in the query syntax you can use the mix syntax actually and let's see how to do that so in place of numbers i can use a bracket and from n in numbers that's it if i press f5 okay so you have to select the numbers also select n if i press f5 you can see we have only three records because three records are less than seven until the condition is true one two and the six if you need to apply the same thing on this query then you can do that as well in the data source from and in names select n and also there is one more thing then you can apply other operators as well in this query if you need to apply where condition then you can write your where condition also here at the last after writing everything you can use your take while method to select only those number of records which satisfy the condition now let me press f5 
here you can see we are having three records which were available earlier as the output of the method syntax. I hope you will like the video. Don't forget to subscribe the channel. Thank you for watching. Have a great day.